Okay, so first things first, I'm going to apply my Becca Professional on my T-zone and the, the zones where I know I'm going to be oily. I'm then using my scotch, yes, to apply my eyeshadow. It is a technique that I've been using again and again and again, and I always start using doing my eye makeup before my foundation, just in case there is some fallout. And as usual, I'm sipping some tea. And I'm using my NYX gel to do my eyebrows. I'm really trying to do something very uh, natural looking. So yeah, I'm not trying to have those big ass eyebrows. I'm just trying to fill in my natural eyebrow shape. I am then going to use a cheap ass um, concealer palette that I bought at Sirens. If you live in Canada, you know Sirens and you know their special price. And then I'm going to use one of their very, very light color as a primer so that my eyeshadow colors can pop the fuck up. And uh, yeah. I am now using my Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit and I'm using one of the contour colors to as my transition as my transition color and by the way that's something that I've been doing more and more to use actually um, a um, non eyeshadow palette to do my eyes because honestly it is makeup you do whatever you want with whatever it is that you have so yeah do not be surprised if in the next videos you see me using a blush uh, for my eye makeup I'm then moving on with uh, my um, oh oops oh, uh, I, I was then moving on with my um, Stila palette. I am now using my L'Oreal palette. They have a very beautiful color, um, which is kind of shimmery that I'm using on my eyelid. And I'm quickly going to do my uh, wing eyeliner. And let me tell you, um, using a scotch is very useful and helpful to do your um, your wing eyeliner it really is going to help to have that very defined line and uh, that's why I like it so much to use um, scotch uh, to have that very clean clean um, feel I am now using my foundation from YSL um, I absolutely love this foundation and I love the color. Uh, I feel like it's really giving uh, more life to my skin, which um, I found a little dull because it's winter and I feel like I'm turning gray. It's going to pop up some colors and it's very warm. And uh, yeah, so I got it for, I think, more than just 50% off. And uh, I will try to leave, to leave a link in uh, the description down below. Then I'm using my favorite concealer, which is from Urban Decay, the Naked Concealer. And I chose not to go too light, I just want a subtle highlight and I'm using my Beauty Blender to blend everything. Then I'm applying my setting powder as usual from Sasha setting powder. Um, I'm going to leave that on for a few minutes.
I'm then using my NYX foundation in the color 15 to actually do some contour. As I mentioned in the, my previous videos, uh, it has become my favorite product as far as contouring. I am then going back with my Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit to bring back some of the colors that I've lost as far as my highlighted zones. And I'm going to highlight using my favorite cheapest pa uh, highlight palette that I bought at my, well, my local beauty supply store. That was that $2.99, $2.99, I'll take it. And I've applied my Naked Lashes, which you can find on mynakedlashes.com in the style Flirt and Whispies. And I'm going to pop up some uh, curls in my hair, in the front of my hair real quick, because uh, this is a real quick get ready with me. And the reason why I'm tucking my hair behind my ears is to make sure that the curls are not too perfect. So when I'm going to release my hair from behind my ears it's going to give a very very nice curl or should i say wave i'm then applying my fudge lip gloss from anastasia beverly hills which is one of my very favorite glosses and uh, yeah i'm pretty much ready to go so as usual thank you so much for watching do not forget to thumbs up this video leave a comment even if it's to say hey girl i watched your video and uh, yeah that will mean a lot to me and that's how you can support my channel so thanks again for watching and see you in the next video Mwah.